Hello everybody, David here. I want to take this speed light and add some wires to it so I can hook the alligator clips onto the battery terminals like how I did in my other video. Three metal contacts right here, and I'm not sure what they do. I did an internet search, it doesn't really say, so I'd have to buy one of Canon's power adapters to figure out what it does, and I don't want to do that. Now, I've already removed the screws from the bottom because they take an awfully long time to remove. I'm just going to open that up. Aha! There are more screws. Now, the battery contacts are right there and there. Let's load some batteries in here. Oh, yep, there we go, 5 volts. Okay, cut a similar length of wire. Okay, 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 I think this is what I'm doing. I'm removing the old contacts. So you can see here's the positive contact, the negative I have right there. And I'm just re-soldering it from scratch. So, here we go. With the wire, of course, held by my helping hands. Yes, that is very good. Now, the other side. Just dropped a bunch of solder on my desk. Oh, that's alright, I'll scrape it up later. Keep that joint up. Okay. Now just to put everything back together. Feed those wires through that door place. And also put the door in. And that's almost the finished product. You have these wires coming out where I can easily hook up alligator clips. Now, actually, I think I'm gonna drill a small hole right here. Okay. Boom. Solid, just wires coming out. And that's it. Okay, now all I've done is strip the ends of these wires with my stripper. Um, it should be six volts. Let's hook it up. Aha! Now I'm gonna fire the flash. Nice. Okay, cool. All right. Well, thanks for watching, everybody. This has been my adding two wires to power my Speedlight 540EZ video. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.